Hello, Internet. My name is Kermit Pancake. And we are playing a game. This game's name? Well, that's a rhyme, but the game name of the game is Drawn to Life. Oh, yes. So let's just start the game, man. So let's, I haven't really used this ROM. So there's some things. Saving Drawn to Life automatically saves your progress. Well, that's nice to know. There are many stories to be told, but this one is special. This is our story. The text looks a bit wonky. Shouldn't be like that for the rest of the game now, as you saw before. It's weird. Long before we or Pose existed, there was a book of life, the design of the Creator. The Creator drew everything in this book and brought it into existence. Well, that's pretty neat. First, the Creator formed a circle and drew our world. Okay. So for this, these are... Basically, this is a drawing game of drawing and stuff. Um, these first few drawings are going to be a bit sloppy because I'm using a mouse. The rest of them... In this game, I don't really use the stylus. Like when I'm playing on my DS, I use the D-pad because it's more precision. So, this, these ones, you have to use the mouse. There's no option to use your D-pad or whatever. So let's just draw ourselves a little world. And, um... Can't use a fill tool, fortunately, so let's just scribble in. And I'm not going to be turning on the mouse for this to keep the magic going or some stupid thing like that, but it seems like I'm actually drawing this. Because the mouse isn't being recorded. Isn't that just splendid or something? I don't know. So let's just draw ourselves a little bit over here. Draw that earth, man. Very important to live somewhere. You can't really live anywhere if there's no place to go. Like the earth. A little peninsula up here. Island. Looks good to me. That's a neat looking plant. Then, the creature populated the world with her beautiful forests. Oh, I can't draw trees, man. And let's just draw the most beautiful trees ever. Some apples in there. Yeah. Some beautiful trees. These drawings don't really do anything in the game, so it's all good. Even we are posed were drawn to life by the Creator's hand. Ooh. Drawing living things that are upright like humans. Very, very hard for me because I'm special. So let's just. Make them all happy and stuff. Those ears. Let's, let's not do that. Jeez. Let me make this all pretty. Wait a second. Uh. Get some clothes. Beautiful. And that's the most beautiful drawing ever. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be great. That's all changed now. The darkness has come and the creator has abandoned us. Well, that doesn't sound very nice to him. There's no more need for this book. There's no more need for us. Oh, that dude looks pretty sad. Creator, we need your help. The eternal flame just went out. And the darkness is creeping in. You're the only hope we have left. Help us, please. Oh, she seems angry. Why don't we respond? How could you just sit there and be silent? Man, she's really pissed. Now, almost everyone has left the village. Her name's Mari, apparently. You're the creator of everything. This is your world. Bring it back to what it once was, please. I would help. I will not help. If you choose, I will not help. It's just kind of like one of those, oh, yeah, pick the wrong one, game over. 
but I'm not wasting time with that. Let's get straight to it. I have heard your cry. Provide a hero to help restore the village. But first, you must gather the villages and bring them to Creation Hall. Hmm? Yeah, you heard me. Is that really you? After all this time, I knew you would help us. Well, duh, I'm the freaking creator of everything. From Jowie and my dad. Hooray! Sound like very many people. That there are more of you people. Raposa, whatever you're called. Jowie! Jowie, come quick! Damn exclamation points, boy. You better listen. He's not answering. Crater, can you tap on his house and wake him up? Uh, sure. What? What's going on? What? Okay. Um. That's not very good. Let me just pause real quick, like... Okay, we're back. I think I made it a bit, bit better. Huh? What's going on? Everything, buddy. Hey, Mario, I was just taking a nap. You lazy bum. Critter just spoke to me. What? What? That's crazy. The Critter hasn't spoken to anyone in years. Jeez, this guy sounds like a weird, real jerk. I'm supposed to gather everyone in front of Creation Hall. Where's my dad? At the gate, he was trying to convince Isaac and his wife to stay. You have to stop them before they leave. Yeah, it doesn't... I don't think it'd be very safe outside this village. It's cold... Whoa! That's some dark stuff. This eternal flame was the last straw. Now my shop is, shop is covered in darkness. Let's bring a flashlight or something. Now our daughter's gone. We have to find her. Hmm, old man. Thinking time. I understand, but we should go out together. This can't wait any longer. We're leaving. Those are some big glasses. Really necessary? Stop, Dad. We have to speak with you. Oh, man. Oh, Mari, Chowie, I'm glad you're here. Isaac's daughter went missing. They just left to go search for her. Dad, the creator just spoke to me. The creator told me to gather everyone and bring them in, bring them in front of the creation hall. Yeah. Speaking words. Young Rappo, you've been talking about the creator for months now. Let it go. But, Dad, it's true. Mari, stop. We have more important things to worry about. You can't be serious, Dad. What about the creator? I'm with Mari. We should at least give the creator a chance. He seems pissed. Stop with this nonsense. Creator abandoned us a long time ago. The, villager, the villagers are, what in, are what's important now. I have a bit of a speaking disability. I'm still mad, though. Don't you question my power. This is crazy, and no one is listening to me. You believe me, Jowie, don't you? Uh, maybe we should listen to your pop. It's Isaac's daughter. Fine, then. I'll go myself. No wonder the creator abandoned us. You said it. The guy's unfaithful. Wait. Ugh, Rappo, what am I getting myself into? All of the things, good sir. All of the things. That's a weird looking building. Door's still sealed. Hmm. Hmm. Crater told me to gather the villagers here, but everyone's gone. Uh, I'm still here. Maybe you should ask the creator for help? Good idea, creator. Could you open the door? Uh, sure. I have ultimate power. Boom! You shall enter. Let's hurry inside. He's kind of casually. Oh, doors open magically. Let's go. <laughs> Imagine. What a ruggedy old place. Cobwebs everywhere. All right, look at all these books. Hmm. Creator, why did you bring us here? What do you need us to do? I will create a hero for you. The mayor's in danger. Um. Nobody ever said the mayor's in danger. But hero sounds nice. Your request requires a hero. A hero? Why do we need a hero? Just bring back the villagers and get rid of the darkness. Mari, your father's in trouble. Oh, man. Who the rapper was that? Was that the creator? No, it was your father. What? My dad is in trouble. I will explain more over time. Walk over to the wooden mannequin. Okay. I filled this mannequin with my presence. 
I will add color to its frame and, uh, and movement to its joints. Together, we will restore the village. Sounds pretty cool, bro. Draw! Welcome to the creation hall. Here you can draw your own creation. That sounds nifty. R will bring up pre-drawn guides. Um, I'm not doing anything. That's just showing you can switch between stuff. Bring, press X to bring the guide to life. Yes. Uh, control pad to scroll through guides. Clear button to start a new drawing. Okay. So, yeah. There's a bunch of different things here. Um, so you, you can, you know, change what, it's kind of faint right now, then you press X, and it's drawn. Yay, but most to use with that guy. Find this guy right here. See ya, pal. Now, I would draw an original hero, but I have the idea where I should pro I, I feel like showing off all the different guides that they have made for you. So, let's start with this guy. He looks pretty nice. And, uh, show off the controls here. You can press B to zoom. Oh. That's an issue. Um. That's great. Let's see if I can do it off screen here. Let me try that. <sighs> okay. So, it's still a bit messed up on the thing. And, um. Yeah, drawing an original hero on this mess, not gonna happen. So it justifies my reason <laughs> more. But, um, let's explain some stuff since you didn't get to see me actually use any of this. Um, you can choose your different colors. Um, you start out with two palettes. This is a different one. I'm not gonna be using that. Stick with the basic one. Now you can click, and then you can click any other button, it'll teach you what it does. But I'm here to do that. This is this bucket right here is the fill tool. Let's get this let's use stamps. I'm not using those. Um I'm not really sure what this lock thing does. Pick a color and then tap here to lock it. You can draw other colors and they won't draw Oh that is nifty. Tap here again to unlock. Okay, I didn't know that. So that's neat. I never really figured that. This is your undo tool, and that's the clear button, as I showed you before. Um, you can press L, or no, not L. Um, when you go into full zoom, you can press L, and it brings up a grid. Very, very useful. Um, that's about it for drawing controls. And, yes. So, another thing. The music in this game is wonderful. Wow, the music came to life. Crater, does it have a name? Oh, we're about to give it one. So let's name him after us. Or rather than me. It'd be weird if your name was this. Crimpin, yeah. I don't think I can fit my entire name in there, and I don't really feel like trying. This'll do. Oh yeah. <coughs> Hi Crimpin, nice to meet you. I need to go find my dad. The crater said he was in trouble. Well, Crippen, show us what you can do. Well, <laughs> yeah. So you see, I added my own colors. You can just kind of use the fill tool to recolor stuff if you want to. Guess we should follow. Oh yeah, man. Follow the weird green armored guy. He seems nice enough. Yeah, the music in this game is wonderful. Even that drawing thing, the, the drawing music that you hear like 50,000 times, it grows on you, and you like it. Where's my mummy? I don't know, did you check Egypt? <laughs> that sounded like Isaac's daughter, Cindy. Griffin, can you find Cindy? She must be close by. And as if it wasn't easy enough, they give you a quick thing. Search around. Yes. So you can talk. Have you looked behind any trees? That's where I would hide. I'm very creative. Cindy is probably hiding somewhere. She loves to play hide and seek. <sighs> okay. Oh man, it's that sun. Opa? Yeah. Maui, it's a monster wapo. No, it's a. Well, yeah, I guess. It's okay, little wapo. Crippen's only here to help. Yes, that's me. Roar. 
Thanks for finding Cindy. We should go find her parents now. Meet us at the village entrance, okay? It's to the south. <sighs> it's just nice music in this game, man. Speak with Mari at the village entrance. Old beater run. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's strange. Whatever. Alright, let's go search the snow fields. Sounds good enough. Whoa. Oh, that music. What have we here? Silly Rappos and their cute little creation? You're too late. The mayor's already done for. Hmm. You better not hurt my dad. Who the rapper are you? No one told you a creepy bedtime story about me? Pity. If you insignificant rappers must know my name, it's Wilfrey. You can forget about rebuilding this village. I've turned up all the pages in the Book of Life. They should be scattered around the world by now. Anyway, I bid you farewell. I have much to attend to. Be sure you don't attempt a pathetic rescue. I'll cover this bridge in darkness. That guy's got some funky music, man. I love it. Ooh, that Wilfrey. It's a funky name, too. What do we do now? We should go find your dad. He'll know what to do. The village entrance is blocked by darkness. We could use the village snow gate to get there. Kirpin, meet us at the snow gate, okay? Yeah, it's northwest of here. Just follow the path until it ends. Okay, seems simple enough. Let's go. Dude, that guy was like crazy, man. Something. So, let's go. And he can command that cloud stuff, too. Hi, Crimpin. This is the village snow gate. We should probably stay behind. The snow fields can be dangerous. Danger! Please save my dad. He shouldn't be that far away. Just walk up to the gate and push it open. I know how to open doors, buddy. Pfft. Tapping's for posers. I use the freaking A button. Yeah! So this is the game. Um, press A to jump. You press... Well, press B does nothing. Y, you do a little shove thing, and X doesn't do anything either. And, of course, use the D-pad to move. So, you tap these sign here. Welcome, press A to jump. Thanks, pal. Um, B does not let you run. We'll do something in the future, but just you wait. Nothing yet. Oh, man, it's a thing. No, it's not. So, it's a very fairly simple game. Ooh, a thing. When you see a green door with an arrow, tap on it. You can get... You can be... You can get coins or even access hidden areas. I don't know what that part was, but whatever. So in this case, we just gained a bunch of rapper tokens. Coins. Whatever you want to call them. Yay, gold coin. Um, silver ones give you one. Gold coins give you five. And I believe red ones give you, uh, ten. Well, they're a bit rare for just ten coins. These are stats to scrape away the shadow gear. Penetrate total shadow. The percentage of total shadow will be... Will... Cleaned will show in the corner. Thank you, Mr. Infobox. So let's just get up here and get to hold down the stylus. Or in my case, the mouse. And get those guys out of here. Get used to the sound. Oh, that's a big pad. Those big patches on the ground, they are irritating. Whoa. Sign. Shadow Walker is up ahead. Jump on it three times. Clear the shadow goof to stop them from appearing. Okay. Sounds good enough. Get out of here, you evil goop. Oh man, a dude. You shall die. Ow. So, your health is represented by how much of the mannequin is uncovered. But, we're gonna have to do more than the next time. Oh, jeez. So, yeah, the next episode, we'll continue through this uh, snowfield area level and fend off more of those black shadow people. Oh my god! How despicable!